Well, this is a place to start. Hello! I'd like to walk one and welcome all to Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. Whoa, this is something. So, I want to actually. St Ooh, it's a little bit too sensitive, I think. Um. No, I want to see the options menu, if that is at all possible. Nope. So, is there actually a way to do that? Can I alter the sensitivity? I don't think I can. Really? I can't. Uh, I guess I just have to be a little more careful. But, Roller Coaster Tycoon and I have a bit of a strange history, and as I survey the situation at hand, I'll explain that a bit. Um, do I have any, what do I have? Um, I don't like loans. I like paying off loans quickly. Because loans get in the way. Um, I like how it stops when I move over an icon. That's kind of annoying. Um, let's see. Uh, where can I get my attractions? Uh, that's my park management entrance fee. That's my finances. Oh, it all stays open. I have a mechanic and a park inspector. I don't think I pay the park inspector, but he's there anyway. Research. I don't care too much about research, actually. Let's plunge down that budget. Lest they take everything from my pocket. Oh, there we go. We have two attractions. We have no shops. We have no facilities. We have no viewing galleries or animals. This is, by the way, Platinum from Steam, so it has everything. Um, I intend to do nothing with this for the moment, so to save my guests the unhonorable right of getting to walk around in circles, I need to look up um, they have those. They still should have those. Small park sign, square park sign. I'm looking for those things that let you stop people from walking into other areas. One of these? Okay, if you say so. How do these even work? Can I... Can I... Can I... No, I don't want to. I want to flick it. Um, no entry. There you go. That should keep people from walking into the undesignated area. So, me and Roller Coaster Tycoon have a bit of a strange history. I didn't know the slightest about how this game is supposed to work. When I was a, a wee little lad, I was always like, oh, what the fuck am I doing? I didn't get it. I couldn't Roller Coaster Tycoon at all. Um, let's see, I always like putting these right up front so that everyone has access to them. Can I get that out of the way? Uh, how do you turn... Aw, oh, I can't use enter. Too bad, too bad. Uh, let's put that over there. I always hit. I have to pay to get rid of green stuff. They're quite angular. But I never got it. I never understood it. And one thing I never liked was the fact that there were time limits. Like, every fucking where in that game. It was like, mm, time limits. Oh, you have to open things first, don't you? Yep. But for some reason, this game starts off with everything, including ATMs, in which you can have no settings whatsoever! Why would I need this to be closed? Closing it down doesn't make it stop running. Why? Uh, anyway, uh, I never got it, but I still enjoy the games. I like seeing the parks. I remember a level in Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 where there is a patch of flowers in the living district. And you could actually have a, uh, I don't know what they're called, janitor, sort of water it for no apparent reason. Okay, this is a roller coaster. If I remember correctly, the idea is that you put less exciting rounds in your roller coaster. People are like, oh, oh, I can do this. This is sort of my basic way of handling parks is to put... I hope that doesn't fuck up. But I like Roller Coaster Tycoon from a, from a pure business perspective. That ought to do it. Why would I want to test that? I mean, like, it's near impossible to alter the, the factors that a merry-go-round has. There's no purpose in that. From what I heard, there's not going to be a Roller Coaster Tycoon 4, because Chris Sawyer, the man who designed this, said, I'm not going to give you the properties. Not that I care too much. I mean, 3 is pretty good. It's, it's, it's a good thing to end off on. But, I'm still quite upset that a man like him would pull that off. That, that's a few stalls. Let's make sure that my finances aren't... Yeah, I'm gonna be in the red with all that stuff. What the fuck is this? Okay, oh, I get it. They made this in the sandbox mode. 
because it keeps track of things that I haven't seen or influenced. It's kind of mean they do that. Can I speed things up a bit? There you go. Oh, look, the merry-go-round's already uh, doing pretty well. Oh, look, it's got a projected profit that's pretty high up. Also, want to make sure you keep track. I don't know, no messages yet. That's always good. Uh, let's see, number of circuits, one. I think one's good enough. Maximum waiting time. Okay, look at that. That thing's already getting some attraction. People on it. That's going strong. I always liked the chair swing. Never really called it that. We actually call it a floating uh, merry-go-round if I have to literally translate it from Dutch. Which I like doing. We we'll literally call it a float mill. Though considering its context, I think it's related to a turn mill, which is what we call merry-go-rounds. The one thing that stands in the way of me actually feeling like I'm standing here is the fact that the camera's so wide. People are having trouble leading the tumble. What? Why does that go both ways? Why does that go both ways? Is my question. Um, that should... What? I remember that you could put down little signs and people are like, Oh, look, we're gonna go over there! Since when does that go both ways? Why would it go both ways? Damn it. I so I can't stop them from going over there. That's great. Well, at least people are going to go for it more. What are people's thoughts on this? I want to go on a tumbler again. Here goes nothing. I enjoyed. I hope they have good maintenance. Yeah. There's vomit everywhere around this place because the tumbler is naturally going to attract some vomit. Considering there's all this candy stolen in the area, one thing I always like doing is charge just a little bit of money for So that at least it isn't... Oh, I just heard someone vomit. That's great. I like how they all seem to vomit at projected locations. Nope, no, it's just random. Though considering the amount of vomit, it would be best to put up a designated park man for this. Let's see, that's this, this, no, that's, oh my, ooh, let's see, everyone's happening, and most people are queuing. Good to see. Um, I could just, you know, give this guy a few recommendations. Let's see, I could do that. Let's see, what's this, laziness? Hmm, do I need that? But they both seem happy. What's he doing? Is he doing good? I hope he's doing good. Let's see, who can I hire anyway? I can hire an animal. I don't need an animal keeper. I can hire six. Oh, I looked. I want to get the tidiest park, despite the fact that there's vomit. First thing I'm gonna do is we're gonna look at this guy. Let's see. Um, let me see your employee. You know, I need your information. I need to give you a training. Makes them more productive. Okay, let's set up some location that you're going to be roaming. You're mostly going to be roaming the uh, uh, preliminary sections of the park. Yeah, that that should do it. That that should cover most grounds, I think. That should do it. Yeah, that should that should cover the grounds correctly. Yep, I'm gonna clean it all up nicely. It's gonna be a tidier park than ever before. Let's see, what's my park rating? New attraction, Lion Show. Lovely. Oh, that's the repair thing. But I thought that... Oh no, there's another repair thing. So they can pick up two. That's cool. I always remember that the mechanics... In Ooh, look at the tree swing. That's very creepy, actually. Because they only... No, they all sway. Oh, it, did I... I need to open this. Get on my ride! Yay, people are going on my ride! What am I... Oh, look, I ran a profit of 300. Oh, the profits. Let's see, how's this place doing? Cleanliness. It's, it's pretty clean. It's got a few spots of vomit left and right, but... Can I up the lift chain speed? Because I always like it when these go faster. Faster. 
Because when this thing goes up faster, it's done faster. And if it's done faster, I can make it go more. Look at that. It's already full. It's going pretty good. Going strong. What are our objectives, anyway? Let's see. Guests in the park, 400. Minimum park value, 20,000. Does that include... Um, let's see. What's my park value? Let's see. Value... Park value is currently going strong. Let me guess. Does it have a... A, a condition can be achieved at any time. So it's just a straight line of things I need to do. Okay. Uh, let's build another attraction. Let's see. What can I build? I can build Crazy Golf. Let's see, um, I could use some dodgems. Fill up this uh, side of town a bit. Build it up a little bit higher, levitate it on the, on the over here. Yeah, that'd be, that'd be pretty cool. People have a reason to go over here. I always like... <laughs> An underground line show, that's something people will come for. Let's see, can I build it up here? How high do we need to build it? Um, can the camera stop correcting itself, please? I don't like that. Um, oh, it doesn't cost much to put it up higher, so that's pretty cool. Let's see, what do I want it at? Um, no, no, that's... Oh, no, that's transgressing on beyond my park limits. That's not good. That's not a nice thing to do on a daily basis. We just build it here ground level. I guess I'll do that. I build my entrance over here, my exit over... No, 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 no. I'm not gonna build the exit over here. No, the exit can go over here, and the entrance can go over here. I build a little swirly swirl. Let's see, what's the park motif here? It's this incredibly barfy. You didn't actually have to barf, mister. In fact, I don't like barfing people. Can I actually do this? Oh! <laughs> This is apparently a thing. I like how they added this in uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon 3. It's... it's... it... this... Like, I'm not the person to talk about Oculus Rift, but... I think that's definitely something that needs Oculus Rift support, because it would be fucking awesome to go through this with that. Uh, this place is all barfy too. Are my employees doing their job right? Let's see, he's just roving, and my attractions aren't exactly going bad. Is he, you know, is he doing inspections? Yeah, he does inspections. The one we'll be able, oh, 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 he's already trained. That's pretty good. What's this? Discipline or fire this? I don't want to discipline him. He's doing good. This guy needs a little bit of level up because he is doing bad. A little bit too lazy to my liking. This man's also being a little too lazy. Let's buff him up a bit. So that they all get to work. Make me the money! I think I can build a balloon stand. Oh, what the fuck? Well, at least I got all my bajingo. Oh, I got best reliability. Lots of people are hungry. Consider placing more food stalls. Well, apparently that's the... The wish of the people. Um, oh, the Z button. That's the button. Um, let's build one right over here. It's the best place in town. Woo! People are indeed very hungry, but they don't seem to be interested in drinks. I want to build a, a balloon stand. Like, oh, you're inside the park here, have a balloon! Did I put down information? Oh yeah, I did. Actually, I think it'd be better if I put the information stand closer to the entrance of the park. Normally, I put the bathrooms close to the entrance because fuck it. I don't want people with bull bladders coming into my park and then throwing up in the toilet or something. Is that only one garbage can? Maybe I need to put down a few more garbage cans here. That ought to keep him from throwing up. See him, um, trash bin. I don't want people making a fucking mess of my park. A custom stall with rotating build- what? 
A custom stall with rotating billboard. Let's build a custom stall with rotating billboard, shall we? <laughs> what the fuck? What can I put in this custom stall with rotating billboard? Uh, let's see, I can make it, uh, umbrellas. Nah, I don't think, I don't think it's very, nah, it's cloudy, but it's not rainy. Let's do that. Yay, I can put it on sale. Synchronize, I always like snow. But it's already ice cream stand, but it's selling great. What's costing me money? I know I'm running a good profit, but I need to see where my losses are at. Right construction. So I made about 400. Right running costs, food and drink stock. Uh, but it makes a lot back. It's it's a big profit margin I'm getting here. Um, ooh, we're gonna, let's see. How much does this loan cost me? It's not much, actually. It's just like 16 euros. It's not much at all. But the research is like constantly taking these pennies from me. Where the hell is my research staff? I want to see what the hell they're doing with my pennies. Hi. Either way, I don't like having loans, so let's click off a thousand. Take your money back, you dirty investors. Let's actually put a, a toilet right here. Might as well. It's quite far away from the other toilet. I don't want people to think that I'm not caring about toiletries. <laughs> See, lots of people need the toilet. Oh, those are, oh, those are very strange uh, trash cans, I might say. What was the message? Let's see. New attraction, insect house. Ooh. Ooh, that's a... Ooh. That would look great at my entrance. Let's see, I'm gonna put it this way. Put the entrance... Over. Exit right across the end... Oh, yeah, that looks cool. What did I get? Tell me to make the emergency stop. Oh, no! Where's my engineer at? Mechanic, I mean. Where's he at? Going to Broken Ride. I have a lot of rides now. Do I need to get another engineer? Is this guy doing his job? Oh man, he's really lazy. Here. Take that. Do some stuff. Well, the laziness might just be how much they're not doing. Like, at some point, they just can't do more. Look at that janitor! He's like, whoosh! And he's done. And the tumbler's been fixed. Let's see. Let's see if there's any attractions. Let's see. This one... What's, what's, what's people's thoughts on this... This old ride? Not many thoughts. I enjoyed. I want to go on Merry-Go-Round 1 again. There's a lot of clientele here. Hmm. And lots of customers means that there's a lot of desire for umbrellas. Because it is... Always good to sell an umbrella. Oh! Look at this man, he's already diligently at work. What a man. You're going to get some training because you're doing your job amazingly well. I like him. What are the projected profits? Oh, it's not running a profit anymore. It's too busy. So then it is making a profit. It's just lying to me. Let's see how we're doing. We're doing great. Uh, let's see. 800 income. It's again ride construction that's in my way. How's this doing? What do people have to think about this? I hope it isn't too scary. I enjoy. Let's roll. Let's see. 250. It's a thousand an hour. Joel Stumbler's failed. You want tidiest park. That's good. It's really good value. That means I can bump up the price with 10 cents and not get myself too concerned. I always wait until people say it's good value before I decide to bump up the price. I hope they have good maintenance. Um, yeah, you should always remember to make sure that your, yeah, downtime is... Mm. Liability is going down. That's never good. People think, I want something more thrilling. I want to go again. 
I got a chocolate cookie. Yum. Um, well, if you want something more thrilling, you can just go to the tumbler. Look at that. Oh, look, it's balloons. I like doing this. Ha ha ha. I loved selling people balloons and then just dropping them so they drop them. <sighs> that was just a dick move. I wonder how much people pay for a balloon holding... St I am your god. I can pop your balloons. It's too busy. Really? Well, if it's too busy, then I might as well build another stall. Run, my little ants. Spend your money. Uh-oh, it's a flurry of people. And they're joining the line. Let's see, what do people think it's good value, maybe? It's really good value. Well, I might as well bump up the price 10 cents and get myself some more projected profits. I love projected profits. Let's put down something decorative. Let's see, what do I have? I have a crazy clock! Let's put down a crazy clock and a cupid fountain. These things always spruce up the attraction a little bit, but, you know... I get a generic building. Here, merry-go-round, here's a generic building. Oh, this will look good. A giant candy cane. These things always do it. You should always put them, like, in places where people are at with the attraction. It makes, an ex it makes that ride more thrilling if there's something in the way. A big old loop de loop with some dice in the middle. That always does it right with the with the kids. That is a giant fruit drop. I think can I jelly bean? Nah. I don't want to put a candy cane over here. I can't really. You have this fragmental system and you don't allow me to put a candy cane there. I want to put a candy cane there, Mr. Guy. Let's see. How am I going towards the entrepreneur? My park isn't worth much. Oh, eventually. Um, let's get out of this. What's this? Auto terrain leveling. Oh! What's happened? The Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. I can only assume that is a sponsored item, and that more than likely, someone paid to have this introduced. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, I think it's time to hire another guy. And I think it's always nice to have a security guard around. Lest they wreck your shit. People need to know what's up. They need to know who's in charge. Equally, they also need to know who's entertained. Are you entertained? What kind of soup would fit this scenario? Let's just do a silly elephant. There you go. I got the safest park. That's always good. Let's see, my rating is through the roof. Let's see, number of guests, happy guests, ride time, ride excitement, litter and vomit is a little bit in the way. Do I need to get another guard? I don't think another Janna would really help here, but... Quad bike. Ooh, that's an exciting ride, but it's, oh, it's one of those... Are there any pre-made ones? There's heavy metal. Let's see, the intensity, the excitement, the knowledge is low, and it costs 2,000. Might as well, you know, might as well. Um, where to put this? I like, not, not too close to everything that it likes blocks up the system. It's a little bit out of the way, I'll confess. Do I have a first aid station? I need to get one. I don't know what they do, actually. What does it do? Injured peeps. That's always nice. Like, hey, look, I'm injured here. Go feel better about yourself. Let's look at my attractions and see if I have any accidentally still closed. Status, popularity, satisfaction, open, people on the ride, open. I could build a piece of animal park. Those things are very good and like one thing I've noticed is that this stuff really well in the game. Like like it it does amazingly well in the older levels. 
Oh man, people are storming for this attraction. What's what's the uh, really good value? Jacking up the price. I want some more projected profits. Look at those people. Let's see. Can I get more cars on the ride? I can't. Um, let me guess. I need to close it first. I can't jack up the car amount, so I have to do that. Three items. Nothing. So how's my custom stall with the rotating billboard? It says Frontier. Let me guess. It's oh another path type. Underwater tunnel. Who's that? Can I can I see that? Well that's another path type, so we know where to look. No, I don't want that. Let's see, which is this? Probably this? Or an underwater tunnel. Controls for Lion Show 1 have failed. Oh yeah! That's fucking retarded. Let's see, um, let's see, what's what's the guests, what's up? What's up in town? Let's see, happy guests 500, Lion Show 1 is fixed. Yeah, those guys are really quick to act, let's see. What do people think about my, um... Uh, I want to go! Oh, anyways, this Buttercup ride. But is it really good value, is the question. Is it really good value? And I have 500 guests. Let's see, where am I, where's my profits at? Oh man, I'm gonna make a lot of profits. I'm ahead of the game, might as well get rid of my loan. That way, I can focus on the future. Rid of the past, focus on the future. Oh, the distraction's really getting some attention. Would do well to put it. What's this? Oh, custom structures. Hm. Small concrete. Can I like build? What exactly is this then? It's a rain block. What? How does that work? Is that gonna crash? It shouldn't. Entertaining one is thinking about quitting. What's his problem? I'm sick of this task. I right, just about enough. What's up, boy? Don't get paid enough. How about I give you some more a raise? Can I give him? A, I can't give him a raise. It seems. Oh, I gave him a raise. I'm so sad. Don't be sad. Be happy. Oh, look, he's much better now. He's got a raise. He's got some trading. He'll be able to entertain everyone. The litter and vomit is starting to get out of the roof, though. 20 is more than I'm willing to pay for. Get to work. Ooh, let's look at my profits. Ooh, there's a lot of profits in there. Why's nobody going on it? I want to own something more thrilling. Well, I got a coaster. What kind of coasters do I have? I have the junior coaster. Let's see, what sort of... Locked. Why is this locked? Hmm. Other rides and attractions. We got gentle rides. Oh, there's a few of those. Playable ship. No, that's a pool side. Yeah, that's a pool slide. Um, thrill rides. Let's see if we. Ooh, the sky sling. It's nice and compact comparatively, but it's really exciting. And with a little bit of luck, we'll be able to squeeze it in somewhere nice. I'll make those fucker. I make that fucker eat his words. But I hope it wasn't so thrilling. Burgers one has just broken down. It's 
Only ups. Oh, look at this. People are swarming for it. Let's see. It's really good value. Is it still really good value? It's really good value. This thing seems popular. Let's go to 130. That seems like a decent price. That's a decent price. Yes, it's still really good value, but it's also doing a lot better for me. Do need to run a profit here. It's really good value! Again. I've locked your kitchen. Stingy with the toppings. Well, the more toppings you get. I say let him choose. Still not running a profit. People have no thoughts about my toilets? Man, what the hell's with this thing? Everyone wants to ride this one today, it seems. Good morning, I wanna go in the tumbler again. I wanna go in the tumbler again. Oh, it just broke down. We drop the price. It's always nice if people see. Hey, look, the price is lower. Let's see. Um, did I do something marketing-wise? No, that's research. Um, I don't care about show elements. I don't care about hats all that much. Um, transport rides. I don't read transport rides. Could go with one soon. No, no. Go, go away. Go away. What's my park value anyway? Man! College newspaper. National newspaper. Let's see, what's a pretty... I think the Tumblr is getting, like, a lot of attention. Everyone wants to go on the Tumblr, it seems. Man, I hope they're not just coming for the porn... Zero weeks remain. Oh, I didn't select a time. Oh, it's one week. Advertising game sex application. That'll drag in some fresh customers. With all these customers, there's always the risk of getting one of those youngums in it. Campaign finished. Aww. Oh. I was just enjoying the fact that people are coming over. I could build another tumbler next to the tumbler. Like a sister ride. I like those. Let's build another Oh, restraint stuck open. It's never fun. So I have to be stingy with the park. I want that, I want that. I think that we've done enough for today. How much has this been used, anyway? Are people gonna say it's really good value? Oh. Call a mechanic. Call a mechanic, that's right. <laughs> well, look, people are swarming for this one, too. How are these balloons faring, anyway? Are people saying it's really good value? Because that's so... <laughs> Is he stuck between... <laughs> oh my god! I need to save him, quickly! <laughs> he was stuck in a perpetual loop of buying balloons and maps!
Whoa! Still sped up and all that. I'm also seeing someone's head. Ah! That was creep. What was that message? Crooked house. Best reliability. What's a crooked house? Hmm. Why would I want a crooked house? Why would you like to see a crooked house? In your face? Wouldn't recommend it, but it's not my pick. Um, this does cut. No, I can still build a road over here. Sort of circumvent the issue. There's nobody going on the merry-go-round. If I can get high flyers some more attention, more people will come to this side of the park. Oh wait, there's another cloud of people coming up. Cloud processing! Oh, oh, oh look, there's the entertainer man. Oh, Miss, you do doing? I oh, hope you're doing fine. I'm sick of this task. I'm feeling great, unmotivated. This least is in the state of happiness. There's not enough people over here. Why is nobody coming to this place? Like everyone is focused in this one area. I get that they would be, but come on. It's a little too much, please understand it is. Wrong way. Can I break it down, please? Buy foam fingers and rubber hammers! Ah, uh, all the peep jimmins. Let's see, why am I not getting my entrepreneur? Oh, well, whatever. I'll see you guys next time. Hide empty categories, that's a good idea. Share swing one. I don't like that everyone's over here. Really don't. Um, the high flyer. Because I really need more people on this side of the park so that these attractions can start running a profit. Instead of just sort of existing in this limbo. I remember the one I used to play, I never put this much effort into organizing my park. Never put down benches or anything. I was like, oh, I put down a, a garbage can, let's just break it. Because at some point they will start breaking your light posts, I remember that. Oh, look at that, there's a little candle inside! It's a triangle, but a candle nonetheless. Let's see, um... Uh, let's actually check out my rides and uh, see the reliability. I'm, okay, so this one's not doing too great. Minute since Lance Inspection 2. It's doing fine, but. Okay, Crooked House. Let's see. How's Crooked House? Crooked House is doing great. Good, good job, Crooked House. Uh, this one's doing good. It's not much downtime, but its reliability is going a bit down. High Flyer is doing terrible. Someone needs to inspect that right now. You got, You got me. We're gonna inspect that ride real good. This one's doing great. But it's an insect house, what will happen? The controls of the insect house are broken! We can't control the insects no more, Captain! <laughs> hmm. Uh, Reese's Buttercups. I think people like this one. I wanna make sure people know it's okay. This top spin's also not doing too great. Man, this thing's doing terrible. Someone inspect this right now. Damn it! Damn it! Man, look at all my, all my fancy pants. Mm. 
make sure this park stays in working order. Security guard number one, you're getting more training. You need to make sure that this park stays tidy and up in business. This park depends on you! Now with all this money I have, I might as well plop down some, uh... Some extra of those in the queue. Especially put them at the end, because that's where the people that have waited the longest are, and you need to keep them in the line. Give them satisfaction for waiting. This line show is not doing too great, but another Q line doesn't hurt. Man, this, this thing is doing amazing! It's getting, it's getting better inspections. Someone is gonna inspect it right now, by the way. Aw, oh, people have been stuck on it. Well, that's why the inspector is coming over. He's gonna make sure this thing's gonna work just fine. See, there's the little maintenance box. I always pick the wrong line. Oh, does it? Well, fine then, if people are gonna... Really good value. That's what I've been waiting for, kid. Let me make sure that people feel justified to stand here in the line by plopping down some. Oh look, it's 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 the roller coaster tycoon ride, or something from Six Flags. It could be anything. <laughs> ah yes, could be anything. Could be anything. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time. This time it was sublime. Let's see, has there been more traction? Yeah, there's a lot more people on this side of town, it seems. But uh, I'm gonna save. Ooh, what's this? It's the, it's the theme map. There's a generic theme going on here, that's good. Theming is good, it makes people more interested in going places. What's this? Showing peeps. It doesn't tell me much. It just shows me that everyone is everywhere. Um, oh, this just shows me interest. Okay, that's an interesting map. Yeah, toggle supports, toggle scenery, or all that stuff. Oh man, people are turning into shadow sh shadow flames. Ooh. Oh, the height. Show path height indicators. There's no path. Oh, there you go. Four meters. Ride height indicators only works for yeah, only works for custom rides. Why doesn't it tell me this one? Too much to ask. Jeez. Oh, this is cool. Man, it feels like geography class. Now you got the tiling. This game's a lot less tily though. Toggle terrain transparency. I can look through mountains now! Yeah. Heavy metal's been fixed. Man, that one guy I sent to patrol this area is really busy, I can only assume. Look, there's actual bugs inside! Oh, that's so cool! Oh, looks! So oh, that's so cool! It's a little sparkle scorpion and a grasshopper. Ah, it's creepy little worms. Oh, that's so baller! Man, this game is details. It's cool. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna save first. Save first. My game that. Episode 1, Vanilla Hill, I think it's called.